So I want to take an inverse of this exponential function. First thing you do in all inverse, or in all in, to find an inverse, let's say that, is you switch x and y. So we're switching our x and y, and now we are going to solve for y. In order to solve for y, we're going to add the 7 over to the other side. That gives me x plus 7 is equal to 5e to the y plus 9. I'm trying to get this y by itself, so I've got to get rid of that 5 next. So I'm going to divide both sides by 5. I now have x plus 7 divided by 5 is equal to e to the y plus 9. Now, to get y out of the exponent, I need to now go to logs. But to go to logs, don't I usually want the exponent on the left side? So let me just rewrite this so the exponent's on the left side. It just makes it a little bit more appealing visually when you do logs. All I did is switch the sides. Because what I'm going to now do is switch this into a log, and I like to have the exponents on the left in order to switch to a log. So I have log base e, because the base of the exponent's e, and then inside of that, I'm going to have the x plus 7 divided by 5, and on the other side, I have the y plus 9. So what I did is I put log right here, and I switched this with this. See how I switched them? Now, isn't y on one side, and all I have to do is get rid of that 9 now, and I got y by itself. How do you get rid of the 9? You simply subtract it off. So once I subtract 9 off, I have ln x plus 7 over 5. Now, could I put the minus 9 in front or behind? Yeah. For now, I'm just going to put it back here. There's a reason why. Now, don't you like also to put y in front for most equations? So this is a fine equation. It's just usually you put y in front. That is the inverse. You could also write it this way. There's different ways you can write it, but that's another way you can write it as well. They're basically the same. Um, so you can put the minus 9 in the back or in the front. It's usually better in front. The nice thing about keeping in the back isn't that really your k value? If you were to graph this, that's really a k value. When it's in the front, you don't see that. Anyway, these two are both inverse functions of this.